for general baseline control of the inflammatory Hi, I'm Dr. Meredith Warner of Warner Orthopedics and Wellness. And I wanted to talk to you today about a natural alternative or a non-synthetic chemical alternative to the treatment of the pain of arthritis, specifically the lower extremity joints, which is what I see primarily on a day-to-day -day basis, along with back pain, of course. We see a lot of hip pain, knee pain, and ankle pain all stemming from arthritis. All arthritis means is that the cartilaginous surface or the smooth coating of your joint is uh, pitted, has divots in it, and it's damaged, frayed, bone on bone, whatever terms you've heard before. That's the the um, actual structural change of arthritis and then what happens is your body starts to feel pain because you start to get down to the bone on which the cartilage sits. Cartilage itself has no nerves so cartilage doesn't feel pain. It's the bone underneath that makes you hurt. Um, so for instance some people who are D deficient will actually feel pain earlier than others in arthritis because this bone plate the cartilage sits on is weak. But I wanted to talk to you specifically today about turmeric and then a combination of turmeric, ginger, and PEA, which is an awesome weapon, a trifecta, if you will, against arthritis. It works because turmeric is heavy with curcuminoids, which are extremely anti-inflammatory and promote the health of cartilage and connective tissue. And then if you combine that with pepper extract, piperine, it absorbs better. So most turmeric or curcuminoids cannot be absorbed by your gut very efficiently unless they're heavily oil-based or combined with the substance that draws them into the cells. So the combination of piperine and turmeric is very effective to treat knee arthritis. And this has actually been studied against ibuprofen and against other synthetic chemicals in the treatment of arthritis. And it's been at least equivalent, if not better, with almost no side effects, if any. And then if you add ginger, which has also been studied head to head against anti-inflammatory medications and has beat or been equivalent to with no side effects, you have a double whammy against arthritis. So you've got two natural substances that can reduce inflammation, promote connective tissue health. And ginger is great too because it's actually, um, it's good for your digestive system and can sort of calm down gastritis, which is the exact opposite of what anti-inflammatories do. Ibuprofen, Aleve, Celebrex, Fiox, Mobic, all those medicines damage the gut. In fact, a single dose can kill your whole gut biome and then you have to rebuild it from scratch. So the alternative would be to take turmeric and ginger. And then if you add PEA, which is palmitoyl ethanolamide, you're even taking care of the damaged frayed nerve endings and reducing the inflammation around uh, the nerves that are causing the pain at the site of the arthritis. Because this naturally reduces inflammation around nerve edges, it's a fatty acid amide that your body produces, but we uh, can add it to turmeric and add it to ginger and enhance the uh, efficacy or the ability of those natural medicines to reduce the pain of arthritis. So I tell my patients to take turmeric for sure because it's heart healthy as well. Um, and a lot of people that have arthritis also have other comorbidities or other health problems um, because, of course, they all start with chronic inflammation, all of these chronic diseases. So most people that get to the stage of arthritis usually have something else going on. Turmeric attacks those too and is help helpful for other conditions. So turmeric plus ginger plus piperine plus PEA, I think, is an awesome combination for general baseline control of the inflammatory pain of arthritis and to help the cartilage health and hopefully prevent things from progressing at a rapid rate. Uh, so hopefully you can sort of stave off the need for any type of surgical interventions or in injections of things like steroids and whatnot.